Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and, and go into the uh, OBD2 tests and then I'm going to click on device control and as the information for what this vehicle allows me to control with the scan tool loads here um, which is going to take a moment or two and as you can see here I've got some things up here at the top some selections um, I'm going to take a look at fuel system and let's just say for the sake of discussion that this vehicle was brought in to the shop here it wouldn't start and I am suspecting that I may have a problem with the fuel pump um, if I go into fuel system here and then click on uh, fuel pump relay here up here at the top um, you can see I've got the selections of on and off and what I'm going to do here is when I select on I'm going to be listening to see if I can hear that fuel pump uh, which is located in the fuel tank on this vehicle operating so when I select this if the wiring and everything uh, and the relay and everything for this system are in good condition I should hear that pump operating and right now I can hear the pump running so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select off and if you take a look over here you'll see the status in this case if I select on there now you can hear the pump running with the status on and then we'll go ahead and we'll turn it off again and so since I can hear that pump I know that in this case the wiring must be working well enough to make that pump operate in order to determine if I've got a bad fuel pump I'm still gonna have to do a few more tests uh, with pressure and flow and possibly current to confirm whether it is or isn't working but at least at this point I've done some simple testing uh, from the driver's seat here with my scan tool to determine and eliminate some things such as the wiring uh, and the relay in this case to see if my fuel pump is functioning Thank you.